Well, hello friends, welcome to my channel, Bad Decisions and Pure Awkwardness. I'm your host, Elizabeth. Today I'm going to be playing with some new makeup. Um, I got some makeup for my birthday that I want to try out. And um, I'm also going to try out um, some Cleona eyeshadows. I have been playing with the new singles that I got. It's um, the first time I've ever bought from the brand. And I got five eyeshadows, so we're going to put a couple on my eyes today. For mattes, I thought we could use this palette from uh, Cine Grace. This is the um, Cine Grace and Temptalia collab. Um, it's called uh, this palette. There were th three, three in the collection, I believe, and I got the one called Quintessence. So we're going to play with this one today. I think we're just going to stick with the cool tones since I'm wearing like a kind of a cool tone shirt. Um, so maybe this one, maybe a little of this one. And then I'll show you my Cleona shadows. We have Lucidum, Quest, Niello, Queen's Banquet, and Monarch. So um, I think we're going to play with Niello and Lucidum today. I thought that would be a fun place to start. Here's Lucidum. I'll put them on my hand so you can see. Ooh, that's pretty. This one's Quest. This is one of my favorites. I did this with a purple look. I'll pop a picture up here if I remember. Oh my god, it turned out so beautiful. Then we have Niello. This one's like green, blue, gold. It looks gold right there, but um, let's see if I can get the green. Eh, there's a little green right there. Um, so that's Niello. This one's Queen's Banquet. This one's like purple, but with like green. Maybe like a brown base. It looks super purple there. Um, you can kind of see like the brownish kind of shade right there. And then we have Monarch, which is like... Um, orange, gold, green, and there's the five that I have. They're so, so pretty. Very impressed so far with Cleona. Makes me want more. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try not to buy anything until like Black Friday-ish, but we'll see if I can hold out that long. Some other things that I'm probably not gonna use that I got for my birthday, um, these are from my friend Katie, so thank you, Katie. Um, I got this little quad from her. Uh, I definitely want to use this. I actually have my eye on this. It's called Big Leo Energy from ColourPop. And it's so cute. It's very neutral for me, but I love the yellow so, so much. Um, I like a little petiteness, and it's Leo, so of course I like it. I'm a Leo. There's the yellow. Super pretty. There's yellow swatch. That's nice. That's really nice. So, um, but I thought it was a little too warm for this look. Otherwise, I would have um, used this with Monarch, that orange multi-chrome. By the way, these multi-chromes are pretty unique to my collection. So, the um, one shade Queen's Banquet looks a little bit like one of the multi-chromes in the, I believe it's the Plain Jane palette from um, Plain Jane Remastered palette from Adept but I still think it's pretty, um, it's unique enough to have it in my collection, is what I'm saying. She also got me this Wildflower Honey Shimmering Body Powder. I don't know if I'm gonna use it for my body, but I'll definitely use it for my face. I think I can use this like as a shimmery blush. So, this is what it looks like. Ooh, that's pretty. That's what it looks like. It's kind of orangey, which I love a good orange. That's super pretty. And it's almost like a super shock kind of um, feeling to it. So I don't know if it's the same formula as that or not. So that's a possibility. And then she got me this super shock chic um, in Darling. It's from the Tinkerbell collection super cute. I don't know if you can see that. Super du duper adorable. Um, I've actually been wanting, I've had my eye on the Tinkerbell um, 
palette for a while. I don't know if I'm going to do it, but um, it's it's on my wish list, I'd say. Um, but that's that's what it looks like. So it's like very bronzy. So I'm going to use this as a blush as well, but like it's obviously a warmer tone or a, a deeper orange and it's shimmery. So that's what that looks like. Very, very pretty. Heard good things about the Super, Super Shock blushes and highlighters, so um, I'm excited to use this. But I think, I'm not sure which one we're going to use today since we are doing like a cooler tone look. If you can hear the rain, you can hear the rain. <laughs> um, it has been pouring down the rain all day. I'm actually getting ready for a date. We were gonna go hiking, or not hiking, but just like walking. And um, the weather has been kind of crappy all weekend. So um, I don't think that's gonna happen. So I'm gonna put on makeup and pretend like we're not going. Um, otherwise I wouldn't wear this much makeup. And I'm just blending out my primer. I'm using the Sigma Primer Stick in Radiance. I'm going to try to go light-handed because I don't want to be like on a first date, like be like, bam, <laughs> you know, all the, everything all at once. Um, so I think I'm going to start with Parallax, um, this kind of like taupey, I don't know, taupey kind of shade to be gray kind of shade. And I'm just gonna put that in the crease. My brush is a little stained. Pick up a little bit more. Like I said, we're not doing anything too crazy as far as like, like smokiness goes. Just a little bit. I also want like a little bit of a base for those multi-chromes to shine through and give them their best advantage, their best chance of looking spectacular. I know they will because they're Cleona. So that's what that looks like. I need, I want a way to be able to zoom you all in. Um, I feel very far away from the camera or I look very far away from the camera. Um, so I have, I'm shooting on my iPhone because I don't have a camera. So any advice you have about doing that on your iPhone would be helpful. It would be really cool if I had a monitor and I could use the back camera and see myself on the monitor. That would be ideal. But I do not have that. I don't have great technology right now, so. Now I'm gonna go into the Reaching Zenith shade right here. That's more like, um, it's like a cooler tone blue shade. And I'm putting that on the outer V. Again, I'm not going to, um, build this up too, too much, but I do want something down for underneath the uh, multi-chromes that we're going to use. I don't play with this palette that often, so I'm glad I'm getting some use out of it. It has some really nice cool tone shadows in it, and it really is a beautiful palette. I just don't pick it up enough. I'm feeling like I'm probably going to go overboard but that's just me, so. If he doesn't like me with a bunch of makeup on, he's never gonna like me. <laughs> you know, I've been really good about going on dates and not going overboard on my eye makeup. One guy actually complimented my, my makeup. He said it was very sparkly and pretty, so. But I try not to, like on the first date, try to like, <laughs> Tune it down a bit. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start out with this brush and I might go in with my finger 
if I feel like I need a little more, I'm dipping into Niello. The shade right here, I'm dipping into this color right here, that's Niello. And I'm putting this on the most outer part, like the about three quarters of the way in, not fully on that outer V. We're gonna keep that matte and I'll blend into it. Um, so we're starting with that. If a guy does not like your multi-chrome shadows, he's not worth it. Okay, I'm gonna go back into Reaching Zenith and I'm gonna blend that into yellow. I guess that's how you say it, Nyello, yellow. I'm saying yellow. I don't know what that means. Somebody look that up for me. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. These are blending beautifully. Okay, I like it so far. And I don't think I need to use, like, I'm not gonna use my finger to get it extra, extra sparkly. Um, I'm just gonna keep it like this so far, and you can kind of see the shift right now, so that's nice. Now I'm picking up Lucidum, this like iridescent shade, and I'm gonna put that on the innermost part of my eye, and that's what that looks like. This one's a little more bluey than that one, but so far. These might be, they're a little warmer than I hoped, but I do think it's very pretty. I'm not mad about it. And if I'm happy, that's all that matters, right? Okay, I'm gonna go off camera, do my face, um, my foundation and everything, um, and then I'll be back and we can finish um, the eyes and we can do like the blush and everything together. I've got my foundation and concealer on and I also put on some bronzer so I'm using which I've been using forever uh, the primer infused bronzer in Sunkissed by e.l.f. I have a pretty decent pan in it everybody clap Woo! so now I think I'm gonna use this one this um, shimmering body powder because it's a little it's a little less orange, um, and we're not going for super orange today. I think I will make a video with um, that little quad um, and maybe put Monarch all over my eyelid. That's what it looks like. Oh, I haven't done this yet. Do you wanna see it? Ooh. Satisfying, eh? Hey, there you are. I am going to grab this little angled brush that I have. Don't ask me where my brushes are from. Half of them, the, um, half of them I got at like TJ Maxx really cheap a long time ago. <laughs> and half of them, or, and or half of them have the brand and the label like worn off. So I'm gonna pick it up with this brush and I'm gonna go gently at first because I don't want a streak of orange. Oh, that's pretty. Ooh, yes. Oh. We're going to be glowy today. I mean, I'm not mad about it, but I don't think I need highlighter. Oh, I don't know if you can see that glow. That's pretty. Very pretty, but I do not think I need highlighter. Not for a first date. We're not trying to blind him here. We're trying to just be a little sort of natural. Me? Natural what? I don't know. Who is she? Well, okay, so, hmm. If you want a super glowy blush, I found it. 
um, there's a little sparkle to it too, so just a warning. So I'm just gonna buff that out. <laughs> oh my god. He's gonna think like... <laughs> gonna be like did did she roll in glitter <laughs> I mean on camera it looks fine <laughs> went a little heavy handed on this side <laughs> let me try to buff that out it's better I am not wearing highlighter today mm -mm. we do not need that not today <laughs> Okay, so now that I'm looking like super glowy, I mean, I'm not, I'm not mad at it. Like normally I would be like, I love this, it's beautiful. Like I love a glowy blush. This is like super glowy, but on a day like today, <laughs> it might've been a mistake, it might've been, I don't know. I don't know, we'll see. I'll let you know. Remember when I was trying to be natural? When I was trying to do like, not a bold look? Yeah. Put some multi-chromes on your eyes and then like super glowy blush. And Let me see, I'm looking at this brush and I'm like, we might be able to diffuse some of that with this one. Cause it's got like long fibers that I feel like might help. Okay, it's looking a little more natural. It's not, it's not, there's glitter, there's glitter. So let me take my foundation brush and try to like buff out some of this glitter. Okay, that's helping. Okay, that helped, that helped a lot actually. So I go in with my bronzer again and just like buff that, the edges. Okay, that's better. I don't have like a streak of glitter on my face. It's not that it's bad. It's just not what I should have done. That's all. Not for what I'm going for. And what I was going for was like a little more natural. It's glowy, it's glowy. You want glow, you got it. Now that that fiasco is over, um, I think I am gonna skip on the highlighter because it's, I'm glowing, I'm glowing enough, frankly. I'm glad that some of the glitter is gone. We just keep the focus of the sparkle on the eyes today. I am going to use a little bit of this nude liner in the waterline and just like, just above, just below my waterline on the actual line itself kind of primes it for shadow and it's gonna open up my eyes a lot I have like 20 minutes less than 20 minutes to get ready I'm gonna take a little bit of reaching zenith the cool tone blue and I'm gonna run that underneath my lash line just like right here just on the outer corner I'm not bringing that in a whole bunch I'm gonna blend that out with parallax just a touch I'm gonna use a flat uh, what is this called this is a flat definer brush from BH and I'm gonna go back into yellow and just gonna put that on the Just gonna line my eye just a little bit with this. Just like that. I mean, all of my profile pictures have me looking with like lots of makeup looks. So he can't be too surprised to see me with bright eyeshadow. And now I'm taking Lucidum. I'm just going to pop that in the inner corner and a little bit on the lower lash line. 
just like that. For lips, let's do Rare Beauty. This is Confident. This is like a mauve shade. And I like this because I, it's nice and creamy. But it's matte. And it stays on the lips forever. So I love it. I'm going to go off camera and do some mascara liner lashes. And I will be back. Okay, so uh, this is the finished look. I put on some Ardell Wispy Lashes. Um, they're like the most, I think they look natural. <laughs> I'm going on a date. I look like this. <laughs> you let me know if you would date me. <laughs> I don't care, like, I think I look great. <laughs> but for a first date, I don't know how this is gonna go. We'll see. Um, but I think it's really pretty. Um, I really like the multi-chrome. Like, I don't know if you can see the shift. Ooh, right there, the shifts of that. So pretty. I'm in love. I'm in love. I love Cleona, and I will be probably getting more. Um, I, the collector in me is like, buy all of them. And my wallet is like, no. <laughs> can't do that right now <laughs> um but yeah uh let me know what you think uh maybe the lashes are much i'm just going with it if a guy can't like me for looking like this all the time then we're not gonna work, work out and that's fine so uh we'll see how it goes Keys on top. Do all the things I was just asking you to do. Let me remind you. Let me remind you that subscribing is free. It helps me out and my channel out. And make sure you comment and like the video, please. It helps me. Thank you so much. And until the next video, I'll see you later. Goodbye. Okay,